Welcome back, heroes, to some more Pokemon Red Secret. Last episode, I don't even know what's going on. We woke up, didn't know who Pikachu was. We saw the legendary beast run past us. We saw a cloister like explode and turn into a ghastly. It looks like Giovanni's found some certain stone that's uh, got a ghastly that's very powerful. I don't know. Um, it looks like it's set before the events of Pokemon Red and Blue in a different region. It all feels like a dream. Some weird stuff's going on. Like we battled Blaine, he had hair. Uh, the war's going on. There's a lab that's, um, they're making genetic experiments on Pokemon. We just got a free Squirtle. We got an Espeon from Professor Oak, who didn't know who we were. Uh, Charmander just joined us. It was Blaine's. Blaine's got rid of it because it was just too weak. And then uh, Bulbasaur, which is now an Ivysaur, uh, managed to escape from the lab. So yeah, we're at the lab right now. We're gonna go up north and see what happens next. Red, wait, take this, it'll be useful. Okay, got a mysterious voice that is just guiding us through certain places. We've got TM, sorry, HMO2, which, uh, yeah, Rock Smash, we will have to teach to someone. I guess Charmeleon for now. It's actually already got a uh, cut, so let's not teach you two HMs, that would be bad. Uh, let's teach that to, I don't know, Ivysaur. But I did a little bit of grinding, uh, it's, it's kind of hard, but the le levels around this game are just weird. <laughs> There's a route with like level 45s, which is. Wait, can I break this? Do I have to like uh, rock smash like that? I need a new badge. Okay. So what do I need to do? Oh, I gotta fight this guy. I think first. Um, need a flint. Okay. Uh, let's water pulse you. Spoke to him before. But he was like saying just go to the lab. And I went to the lab and nothing really happened in the lab. I guess we we'll check it out first. So beat this dude, then we can use rock smash. It looks like isn't this uh. Brock's dad from the anime so later you'll meet Bruno don't tell him you saw me he's my first son just have to go back to Kanto okay got a Dragonite just in between all these uh, magic up so now we should be able to uh, smash this nice okay uh, yeah so let's keep exploring not sure what's gonna happen next I'm assuming the the high levels and some of the grass just Basically, a, a good way of telling us not to go a certain way. Got level 25 Caterpie. Okay, that's not too bad. I'm gonna take out some of these Pokemon just for the experience. Also, gonna use the rare candies just to level up, level up everyone a little bit, just to even out the levels. Cause yeah, managed to get Pikachu to 24, but that was because the rare candies we got last episode. So let's uh, 26, 26. Now everyone's level 26. We'll hold on to these last two rare candies. I wonder what the last Pokemon we're going to get is. Maybe Snorlax, but... Oh, Giovanni! My Voltorb should have learned to self-destruct. I have no time to waste with you. Okay, now he's gone. <laughs> so anything down here? Nope. Okay, uh, let's keep following the path. Uh, let's go down this way. There's just like so much to explore, but I don't want to go the wrong way in case we get into a really difficult fight. <laughs> Alright, going to go water balls on this and... Oh, go on, hurt yourself with fusion. Nice! Very good, very good. Ooh! Seeing all the Pokemon out about is really cool as well. So these shrines you get healed up at, but when I was doing some grinding, I lost to like a level 35 Venomoth. Oh, he's fighting Lance again. I got sent back to the start, so ideally I don't want to lose. And there's a lot of Gyarados, Dratini, and Dragonair watching this fight. Voltorb, self-destruction. Oh, and he went flying. Oh, it's a Haunter now. Oh, a Voltorb and a Haunter, okay. So Lance just went flying. Is Lance dead? Can't go that way just yet, gotta go to the cave. And Giovanni is discovering ghost type Pokemon, it seems like. Oh, Bruno! Okay, uh, if we go fight you, best to lead off with Espeon. Yo! You interrupted my training! I did! What are you gonna do about it? Level 28 primary. Okay, so we're, we're a good level then. Let's just keep side, side beaming and side tosses. Fine. Nice. Yes, give me all that experience. Matroke, yeah, we'll just stay in. Keep side beaming. Until we get taken out. If we're gonna get taken out. From the look of it, I doubt it. <laughs> oh, fake out. Look at that little damage. Then side beam destroys you. Easy. So I left to uh, look I left to look for my father. My mother told me that he left with a young girl named Lola. If I find him, I'll make him pay. Oh well, if you wanna find him, he's just um just head a little bit to the west. The, uh, the, the experimental factory and you can find him. You can go and kick his butt. Not that tough, I'd beat him. <laughs> so now Giovanni's got a shiny Haunter. So Voltorb is gone. But welcome Haunter. Let's go to 
a con. Okay. So Giovanni's just, just, you know, killing things. Like, I think he, Cloyster died and Ghastly was born and now Voltorb dies and he's got a Haunter. Oh, so it's like, I said like Mount Moon, all the Clefairy around. This is cool. Right, let's get healed up. Not sure what's going to happen next, but going for a cave, I think I'll lead off with Ivysaur and Water Tool just so we can Water Pulse and whatever grass move we've got for Ivysaur. There's two ways to go in. Oh, yeah, it doesn't matter which way you go in, just <laughs> both lead to the same spot. Oh, Clefable. Or oh, Clefairy. There are rumors that you came from space, from the moon. I'll find out more about you. Okay, so he's just kidnapped a Clefable now. Giovanni's just doing a, a lot of stuff. I'm, I'm still convinced it's got to be a dream, right? I have no idea what's going on. But it's interesting. Can we take the berries? Nice. Gonna take all these berries. Because we're a scumbag and we take the berries. Oh, Chikorita. But we don't plant them. Uh, level 35. Get some good Charmeleon Fire Fang, yeah? Give me some decent experience. Like, I don't want to get too OP. Because obviously some of the wild Pokemon are super strong, but the, the trainers we have to fight don't seem that higher level than us. Uh, oh, okay, let me run, please. Let me run! It's gonna lead off with Charmeleon. A little bit easier. Ice berries, gonna get all the berries. But so we've got some repels if we we really need to like stop encounters, but we haven't got anything high enough level to really make use of the repels. <laughs> but I guess like a little high risk, high reward right now. Go into the garage and get the berries, but there's a quite a high chance you're gonna run into a Chikorita. Level. Okay, that was 25. That one's fine. So if it's 25, I wouldn't worry. I'm gonna grab all these berries because you never know. Might come in handy. This could be a good place to grind. There's a shrine close by. I mean, it'd be a good, good place to grind for Charmeleon at least. Everyone else, uh, maybe take a bit, bit more time, but... To be fair, these Chikoritas are doing what? Light screening, natural gift, they ain't doing much. Like, I can just sit here for days. Killing Chikoritas after Chikorita. Getting the experience. And last one. Alright, so we get paralyzed, poison or whatever, we are fine. We've got a Gloom! Take you on. I've got five PP left from Fire Fang. Gotta be a little bit careful. Oh, don't paralyze me. Although it doesn't really matter. We've got berries. Yeah, goodbye, Gloom. Oh, one last encounter before we get out. Oh, I'll fight the Gloom again. We've got Giga Drain. Come on, one more Fire Fang. Beautiful. Alright, let's go get healed up. How do I... Okay, go around like this way. This world is just so interesting. Like, it's quite fast paced as well. Like, so much to like explore and just... Just so much happening. You have no idea what's really happening, but... <laughs> hopefully it all makes sense soon. You know, we can just keep going on and then eventually discover what's actually happening. So let's go down this way. Oh, Lance, you're alive! So Giovanni is in possession of the Curio Stone. It's a dangerous stone. We have to stop it. Okay, but... Yeah, how? You just keep teleporting away. We've got five more rare candies. Sweet. Uh, gonna get one level 30 if we can. Flamethrower, yes please. Gonna get rid of... Fire Fang. Mm, I don't think I can get one level 30, but... Just try and get everyone kind of equally leveled as well as possible. Apart from Charmeleon right now, but I should go Pikachu and Water Tool get these 28. Right, so what are we doing here? Oh, Snorlax, hello. It's gonna fight Snorlax. Uh, I don't know if we can beat this. Depends what it's got. Oh, it's got leftovers, great. I'm gonna try and be a little bit cheesy. Nice. 
And double team a couple of times. And with any luck, you'll keep missing me. And then I can just... Ooh, okay, that's fun to wave you. Nope, you land your attacks. Great. After all them double teams, I was hoping you'd just miss every single hit, but... I guess not. Come on, Charmeleon. Uh, that's Flamethrower. It just does, like, no damage. Okay. Slash, maybe try getting crit. Why is that, like, so strong? We're gonna be here forever, aren't we? Them crits were doing, like, nothing. I guess maybe if I can get the confusion with Psybeam or Water Pulse, then you can just fight yourself. Nice. Paralyzed. Come on, confusion. We need the confusion, man. Maybe we should go for Bite. Okay, it's too late now. Let's go Bite, get the flinch. Yes, no, that's an absolute beast. If this joins us, though... Hey, confusion, nice. And you hurt yourself, that's good, that's good. Come on, Espeon. You're the chosen one. And paralyzed. I think three more side beams and we win. Nope, one more, because you hurt yourself. Ah, oh, fantastic. Woo! So you'll be useful. So now we've got a, what, level 35 Snorlax? That's, yeah, that's definitely going to be useful. Uh, I'll get healed up. Oh, Team Rocket's here. Uh, hey all. I was looking for my mother. They managed to uh, capture Mew, but I uh, never heard from her again. Okay. So, Mew's your mother? Was that, did you get it? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna spark and water pulse trigger in the coffin first. Thank you for missing them Fury Swipes. Nice, got the paralysis. Didn't do too much. Oh my god. Uh... Gonna switch into Snorlax and bite ya. I'm gonna try and just get Pikachu as many levels as possible. This game's just it's it's difficult, it's interesting, but it's a bit hard. <laughs> Come on, water pulse. Nice, hurt yourself. Or just crunch actually, that'll be fine. Again, intimidate. Ooh. Mm. I'm gonna body slam me out and keep water pulsing. We get the paralysis or the confusion. Good. Or just body slam takes it out. Fantastic. Let's go body slam. Hey! Even with the intimidation, it does so much damage. <laughs> Whew! Snorlax is the key to victory. Okay, let's uh, get healed up again. And then we'll go inside this building, see what happens. Uh, what is this? Oh, Silver, I hate my dad. Oak, I'm glad my parents separated. My mother, Agatha, is great. Together, we'll conquer the world. I left my wife, Sandra, because Delia was also expecting a baby. The only solution to disappear was to join Team Rocket. I don't know if I'll ever have the courage to go home. Right, so leader Silver. It looks like, um, oh, what's his face? Uh, Archer, is it Archer that his name? Level 40 Rapidash. I mean, he's the, Static's, you know, working. We'll go water pulse and okay, it's fine, it's fine. Get the confusion. Nice! Play yourself. So we, we can take a flame wheel. Come on, water tool, you got this. You got this. Oh, Stomp's gonna kill me though. I'm gonna crit as well. Alright, Espeon. I could just go Snorlax and Body Slam, but I wanna try and train up everyone else a little bit. Nice! Sweet. Mm, morning sun, should we get that just in case? I think we should. Chikorita, that'll be easy. I can stay in for this. Level 5? Okay, you have a level 40 Rapidash and a 5 Chikorita. I have to report everything to the other members. Okay, then you do that. Uh, I guess we can go down here. Oh! So that leads back to the, um, the lab? Somehow? Anyway. <laughs> This game doesn't make sense at the moment. Too much sense, so I ain't gonna question it. Uh, so uh, take this, it'll be useful. Oh, thanks. What is it? You're destroying the Pokemon world with your Pokemon. Stop. Thanks to my research on Pokemon, if I can't bring my cloister back to life, at least I can use his spirit. D what? <laughs> In this laboratory, our work is finished. Goodbye. Ah, oh, I have my revenge. Okay. 
Um, right, so what... Is this surf? Let's get rid of withdraw. I want to keep that just in case. So there's a few ways we can go now. But I'm not too sure which way we want to go. There's that weird cubone as well we saw last episode. I think I'll check that out maybe. Uh, it's probably spoken to you. So yeah, nothing over there. Let's go back. There's also that dude with the Kangaskhan we saw back on Route 16. And in the grass by level 45, there was a dude with a Rhyhorn, like a Team Rocket member. So I guess I'll go speak to them first. Should also save the game just in case something bad happens. So I had to go to some very, you know, dangerous territory. Some very strong Pokemon coming up. But yeah, this game just like, it's like, feels like it's just go, go, go. It's great. Route 12. Let's worry about the Hypno. Wasn't there like, yeah, water down here? So we could essentially surf down this way, see what we can find. And that just, oh, leads us here. Okay. So let's go across, talk to you. So Mr. Pokemon. Oh, I'm making Pokemon fight. I made a discovery in Glebe. So you want to fight Mr. Pokemon? Oh, he's a leader, a level 45. Why are you so tough? Uh, I'm gonna Thunder Wave. Didn't get the uh, paralysis from Static. That sucks. All right, Snorlax, you gotta kind of help us out here a little bit. Got like no potions. I might end up losing this fight. And Jewel, that's fine. That's fine. I might do some more grinding as well. Yeah, I'm not sure I'm supposed to come this way just yet because it feels like it's a bit too OP. Crunch, I'm dead. Uh, water tool, can you finish off Kangaskhan? I mean, if you win this, you'll get a lot of experience. Oh, that was a crit as well. Uh, Charmeleon, surely you can live like one attack. Nice. Okay, last dude had like a level five Chikorita next. Please have like a very weak Pokemon. Marowak, oh, I think I'm super dead here. Oh, 28, that's fine, we can do this. Hey! I was thinking it was going to be level like 45, and I was like, oh, this is so over, but a 28 Marowag, nice. So, see you in Glebe. Okay. Where's, where was Glebe? <laughs> I don't even know what's going on. We haven't got a map, have we, to like, no. Uh, where was the healing? Shrine again, there it is. So I I don't know where Glebe is. The only thing I, I know I oh no wait, we need waterfall, I think, to get to the that cubone. I can at least go over this way. Let me just check. Make sure I miss anything. Oh the shrine literally just there, could have gone right instead of going all the way back. Alright, so let's go across here. Oh, okay, we probably want to go up that way. But there was a dude over here I want to fight. So if you've got a Rhyhorn, we definitely probably want to just like water tool and surf it. Oh, Archer! A guy named Giovanni offered me a large sum of money if I could teach HMO3 Surf to a ground type Pokemon. I've done it! Let's go, Rhydon! This battle will go without a hitch. Okay, now you got a Rhydon. And this is Archer. Uh, let's surf you. Oh, you're going to surf me. <laughs> Well, yeah, I think you've only got Surf. Well then. <laughs> oh, this game's crazy, but it's, it's pretty fun. You got a Hound Owl, what level is this? 10. <laughs> so it seems like if they've got a strong Pokemon, the next one's not going to be as strong. Uh, okay. Anything? Let's go check down below first. Oh, okay, Ponyta. Okay, relax. Oh, I'm gonna have to fight some trapped on and fire spin. Oh, we missed the inferno. Missed the inferno again. Nice. Hey, that's good. Wait. Oh, that's where we came from. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go across 
us here. So we haven't been up this way yet. Route 02? Uh, okay, so that's... Oh! I can go across here. Okay, that's... Right then. Um, Lieutenant Surge, I'll go and guard the city where we're taking Mew. Goodbye. Okay, sure. we got a Pikachu with like a yellow ball. What is going on, man? Oh. Let's go. Wait. We're the best. Was I not supposed to come this way? I don't think I was supposed to come this way because that a thing happened. But Raichu's there, so... Oh, I might have messed up. I don't think I was supposed to go this way. But I will rocks. Can't use that here. Okay. Uh. Well, the tree's gone now. I'm not sure if that was the right way. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. I might. I don't know. I'm, I'm thinking I might reload the save. Just in case I wasn't supposed to do that just yet. Because we don't want the game to break, do we? So I won't save it, and if it does break, then I'll just redo some bits and bobs. Let's we'll see where we can just go. Mm, Alright, Route 14. Nothing around there. So this is the cave that we came through before. So there's maybe two ways to go? Let me pop a rappel. Repel, repel. So we can't get down there still. We need waterfall to get to the Cubone? Oh! Uh, that Pokemon, I know its history well. I've often come to this cave with my grandfather as a child. This was a volcano. On the ground floor lived several Geodude and Graveler. But on the tip of the volcano, there were several Charmander, Charmeleon and Charizard. An earthquake caused by two Graveler cha challenging each other caused everything to collapse. All the Charizard flew away, saving the group. Except for one, who couldn't find his baby. Charizard found and protected Charmander with his body and then the cave was collapsing. Charmander was left alone and waited in vain for Charizard to recover. It sacrificed its life for its baby. Oh, that's really sad. So Charmander grew up alone in this cave. I'll tell you the rest of the story once you defeat it. Take this will be useful. Okay, so now I've got to go defeat it. I guess I can't catch it, so we've got no balls. So waterfall, I've got to teach you to water, uh, to water tool. Let's get rid of rapid spin. So it's a Charmander, I guess, with a Charizard skull. Ooh, five rare candies. Uh, it's definitely just teach some moves. Not teach moves, so I uh, grow some levels. Uh, don't want slam. Twenty-nine, thirty. Alright. Oh, there's Charizard, sorry, with a like Charizard head. Kinda of messed up. Dark pulse. Uh should off a waterfall. Throw a water pulse. Uh, confusion. Uh, let's go. Pikachu. Oh no, you're gonna be probably ground type I'd assume. Ground fire. I doubt you'd be fire flying like a Charizard. Uh let's body slam here. Fence drop, which is not good. Paralysis with body slam, but it's, it's fine. We can still maybe win this. The crunch is going to kill me though. If I, yeah, I can't outspeed you. I might lose this fight. Come on, Charmeleon. You got this. Dragon Breath. I got flinched, of course I did. Right, I might do some grinding. Uh, unless you can do this, Sleep Powder. Live. Oh, oh, maybe, maybe. Let's go rock smash against your dark type. No, you're not. Sea bomb. No, it woke up. I should have gone for double. If I had double seed bomb, I could have maybe won that. All right, so now we're back here. This is like the start of the game. So I can, I don't actually mind starting here because I can look around and see if there's um any other places to surf. I don't think there is, unless we, you move out of the way later on and we can go up that way. 
I think we have to win this fight, which... If, if I lose again, I'm gonna have to do some grinding. Can I go in this cave? Nope, still can't go in there. So... Back in here. Was there... Uh, oh, this is Gleeby. Okay. It's like, I can't remember, like, the, where the places are. There's definitely more to explore around here, so maybe once we deal with this Charizard, we can then go to the left down there. Let's try this again. Like a water pulse. Oh, stone might kill me. Oh, it didn't. Confuse it. No confusion. Uh, if you're gonna go Ivysaur, try Sleep Powder. Please don't miss. Oh, we missed. Of course we did. <laughs> Sometimes you can't get lucky twice. Right, body slam. Oh, the paralysis. That's fantastic. There you go. Now we win. Now we win. That's all we needed. Ooh. Sweet. Uh, amnesia. Sure. Let's go to sleep talk. Give me all that experience. So, thank you, Red. Here's the last part of the story. So, a group of Geodude attacks it. Uh, Charmander builds armor with its mother's remains. Oh my god. To defend itself. Charmander then joins a group of Sandshrew. Only to remain alone when they evolve into Sand Slash. The flame on Charmander's tail went out. At that point, Charmander realizes that it had become a Cubone, and after a few weeks of uh, being alone, it evolves into Marowak. Marowak finally returns to the top of uh, Glebe, encounters a Graveler, and the battle begins. Graveler was having the upper hand, but Marowak transforms into a Wackor, and defeats Graveler, and now here we are. It was the only example of Wackor. It's good that it's gone. Thank you, Red. Now we're free to cross the... Uh, now we're free to across the cave. I'm moving to Johto. I'll call myself Mr. Pokemon. Goodbye. Oh. Oh, that's so sad. So a, a Cubone in this game is just like a, a chum and that's tail has gone out and... That's so sad. Um, question is now. I said go across the cave, but... Where do I go? Do you think I can now go onto the other side of the... The cave? I have no idea. <laughs> I'm not saving the game yet as well until I know we get past the Lieutenant Surge bit and everything's all good. So here's all the sand shrew. Uh, let's just get healed up real quick. So can we go through here now? So I can't go that way. Where do I go? Alright, let me go explore. Because I don't know where I'm going. Maybe someone will appear or something. There's got to be something we can do. Okay, so inside the lab I noticed uh, things have evolved. So every Metapod and Venat that evolve from this city onwards will be different from the ones before. Okay, we succeeded. Okay then, uh... From now on, all Slowpoke will evolve into Slowbro. We sacrificed all uh, Turban to do this. And then your Ditto. Oh no! It was a mistake! Uh, we already took Mew away in a uh, pickup truck. The ship just set sail. You'll never catch up. Okay, so... Now we're spoken to you. I guess we try and find Mew? Oh, they're all evolved as well now. Uh, so you can say the same thing as before. They're all good. Uh, Flint's obviously gone. Can't defeat with the Dragon Knight. Uh, let's get healed up. It's gonna keep going this way and maybe go back to where Lieutenant Surge was, and maybe we can rock smash that rock. So I assume that's probably the way I want to go. I have no idea. There's like no direction, which is cool. We got this area here, or maybe we can like. Do we want to go that way? Got a cave and we can go... That way? Okay, so can we go in here now? Oh no, this is about battle Bruno. Oh, there's a place that we couldn't go, so let's... Go this way. I don't know where this has taken us. Isn't this by where we... 
Oh, what do we do? This is near where we got um, slides about Jesse and James. So I don't know. This is the Clefairy place. I'm gonna assume I have to surf around that area. Cause there was nothing. I'll double check in here. I don't think there was anything to kind of do around this bit. Yeah, it was just see Giovanni get Clefable. Which I assume is gonna is gonna kill it and go into a Gengar, maybe? I got this place. Oh. Uh, can I run away please? I'm just trying to explore. It's not proper repel yet. So let's stay around here. Nope. Just gonna surf around every little bit I can. So this is where we yeah, got Snorlax and we battled. Oh, did I not go this way? Oh, I have a strange feeling. So I want to go. Ah, okay. <laughs> this is the way I want to go. Ah, what do you want with me? Oh, okay. And now it's blocked off. Right, okay. Uh, that was scary. I was not expecting that. Oh, hello, versus Giovanni. Uh, how do I get to him? Oh, I'll run this bit. Ah! Oh, hey, hello, one. Giovanni has lost it. And Lance said this Curio Stone is dangerous. I'm going to destroy it. Oh, it was Celebi. So Celebi is guiding us. Ah, okay. So now we know who the mysterious voice is. Oh, this is where we came from. This is where we saw Lieutenant Surge. Lieutenant Surge does this, and then this opens up. We can go this way. So now we've got to try to figure out which way to go. So that's the order of things you you should do it. And then uh, maybe this is opened up for us. Ah, I see. So I just did things in a, a little wrong order. But now we're back here. I can think of two ways to maybe go. The first is, is this unlocked? Nope, still can't go that way. Worst case scenario, I'll just have to reload the last save and just make sure I do it in the right order. Uh, if not, I'll just go wrap around. I'm going to try and go through this way. Can I go through here now? Nope. I'm just going to go back to the start and see if anything happens. Guess not. Right. Let me look around and see what else I can find and cut to where I'm supposed to go. If I can't find anything, I'll just have to quickly reload the save. Okay, so I have looked around everywhere. I even restarted the game, did it in the right order. And I think, I don't know, maybe the game's bugged. I feel like the way that um, Mr. Pokemon was saying once we defeated the, the Wackle, it seemed like I'm supposed to now go through the cave, like the like area on the left is supposed to unlock, but I've run around the whole place I can do, every single place, multiple times, and I just, I can't see anything, there's like no way to go, so, um, I'll see if I can get in contact with the creator or something, or maybe keep looking and try to find something, but for now, I don't know if this game's finishable, but I'll have a look, and hopefully we can continue this series, because so far this game is banging, I want to know what's, what's going to happen next. I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Peace.